Hello everyone, welcome back to today's video. Today we are checking out the realistic ped damages add-on slash resource for 5M. You can find this over at the GTA Police Mods website. The link will be in the top of the description if you wish to download it. Alright, so what this does is it makes it so tasers don't kill peds anymore, the night picks doesn't kill kill peds as easily so you can hit them multiple times and fights last uh, way longer than they would just so it's more realistic for your role playing or 5pd playing this does work with 5pd perfectly fine so that's really really cool it also allows you for optional longer stun times like four seconds five seconds six seconds eight seconds or 12 seconds depending on what you want for your server to be more realistic with real life so all you have to do to do and install this is press download go ahead and press agree and download and you can see it downloads a dot zip file Go ahead and open this up. I'm going to assume you already have your server data folder where your resources and your server.cfg file are found. If you haven't set up your server so far, make sure to go set it up by watching our how to create a 5M slash 5PD server, and it will explain to you how to get to this point. You don't need 5PD for this to work, but I do recommend it because it makes it a little bit more uh, realistic, but you could also use this on just your typical 5M server. So you have two options. You can either use the default realistic damages um, thing, which is the default tase times and everything, or you can go into the optional page and find which taser one you want. So if I wanted to taser for eight seconds, all I have to do is go to my resource folder. And then inside this taser for eight seconds folder, there's another realistic damages folder. Go ahead and drag that into my resource folder. You can either leave this named like realistic damages or something, or you can just right click on here, rename it to like taser. Either one works. I'm going to keep it as taser because it's a little bit easier for me to remember what it does. Then I can go into the server data.cfg file. And if you have haven't already watched any of our past videos all you have to do is either add start or ensure uh, the name of the folder in my case I renamed it taser so I'm gonna name it ensure taser um, and that's all you have to do go ahead and close out of this folder go ahead and use your start.bat or starter.bat file or however however you start your server up and go ahead and double click that and let it load up so you can see it's loading up 5pd and it's loading up all of my other uh, resources I have and all I want to make sure is it says loaded started resource taser and or realistic damages or whatever your folder name was called that's all you want to look for then you can go ahead and launch 5m and load into your server and see if it has successfully connected and worked and we can test it on NPCs or AI or other players as well it works for all of them uh, which is pretty cool so we're gonna go ahead and direct connect to our local host server now and we're gonna take a look and see if this worked fine and as long as there's no errors when you're logging in everything should be terrific there we go so you can see we have loaded in um, one thing I did want to mention for anybody learning and how to do this for the first time and everything make sure you already have your server working before you try to install external resources and if you have issues with any external resources make sure to ask the author before asking 5m support or 5pd support or any of this because we get flooded with these support requests especially in comments of my videos as well um, which are common fixes which many others have had so make sure to use Google and other resources before you ask your question just to make sure no one else has asked it before you all right so we have loaded in and we're going to go ahead and give ourselves um all weapons using our uh simple trainer which we went ahead and added using our trainer tutorial you can find that over in the trainer um to, i'll leave a link in the description to that video is what i meant to say i'm going to go ahead and switch into my 5pd cam here so you can see or 5m cam and you can see that um full screen and you can see that this did work i'm sorry if i'm stuttering or anything right now i'm really tired i was just on a call with group members for the past like three hours and i am very very tired and my voice is tired and you know the typical so we have teleported over to the road over here i'm gonna go ahead and find some poor person in a car which we're going to test this on and you sir will probably or you ma'am i can't tell yep ma'am will probably be the unlucky one to test so you can see the taser if i go ahead and hit the ped with the taser one two three four five six seven eight so you can see it is a realistic taste time of about eight seconds depending on what you did and um what you enabled inside the uh, when you downloaded the resource for your time. So you can see they stay down more, but they also don't die. So they'll actually sit up after that tase time. So they won't die no matter how many times you tase them. Uh, they won't actually die, which is a cool feature. Um, so yeah, all those cool things are included. Also, if you use like a pistol or something, um, you can see it shot instead of hitting. Um, so normally when you're standing next to someone this close and you press the button, it will actually hit them. 
and rather with the gun rather than shoot so this disables this mod disables that and it uh, makes it so you can't it doesn't hit the player when you are standing right next to them um, so that is a cool feature this works with in-game players as well so this is not just NPCs this works with in-game players as well so lots of cool features and stuff um, if you want a tutorial on anything else make sure to leave it down in the comments below this week I'm hoping to get the first episode out of our call out tutorials on how to create a 5 PD call out so make sure to stay tuned subscribe like and comment and I'll see you in tomorrow's video